Ladies and gentlemen, it is your boy Robin Skulls, and today I present to you a Team Deathmatch admission. However, today this will be a little bit special because I will not be doing the commentary on this. It's this guy, George. Hi, George. Good afternoon, sir. Thank you, Mr. Skulls. Um, now, basically, I, I like to play a lot of games. Oh, the loud is very loud on this side. Don't you turn this down? Can you turn this down at all? I need to put some mute on this. Because I tell you what all I can hear is the bloody gunshots. And I tell you what, back in my country, we don't like the gunshots at all, so there we go, that's better. Anyways, um, basically, all I came to this country to do was to earn a living for my family back in Uganda. Um, but uh, I started playing a Modern Warfare 3. I went down to Mr. Skull's house and I said to him, I had a fantastic opportunity for him. Basically, if he gives me his bank account number and thought code, I can get him time shares in anything that he wants in a wealth there. However, when he was playing, he said, I can't, I can't listen to what you've got to say because I'm playing the chord. And I said, what is this chord? I hear a lot of this chord. I think I need to get me a place at this pie. So basically, I sat in Mr. Skull's front house and I said, give me a go of this. I said, what are you using here? He said, a pin ante, basically, I don't know what secondary weapons, I can't remember, and some sort of assault package. Um, I, I, I went into the, into the servers and somebody started saying stuff to me, it was like, oh, look at this, um, you, you like to have sexual intercourse with your mama. I said, don't you? Yes, and there was an awkward silence as well, I didn't know what's going on. Anyway, sir. Um, basically, we are just uh, playing this game. As you can see, I got my UAV. Um, the UAV is on there. It's very nice. And um, this is a game where I, I, I like to... Um, I, I, don't, I don't really know what to say about this game. Mr. Scott, can you come in and, and, and say some things? Because what's this guy doing? He's got a bloody share look. I don't know what to say. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, yeah, I was watching George as he was doing this. Um, he was playing a good game. I was giving him some pointers, some tips, of course. I was saying, right, watch this. To pull your secondary weapons out. I think we've got the M9s dual welded there. Um, just to let you know, George. Oh, thank you, sir. I didn't really know what it was. You see. Yeah, it's, it's all right. This is your first game. You die from a predator there. You've got to watch on the top because predators come in and whatnot. Now, you've got a predator there. So, if, I don't know if you want to use that now. No, I thought you were going to use it there because you just said, yes, sir, I just laid down because because my feet were very tired from all the dying and the running around, sir. This gun is very heavy. Back in Uganda, all you get started with is an AK-47. Right, now, now, yeah, here you go. Now we're going to use it, right. Try and go for those two there. Try and get a double kill. Try and get double. Well done. Oh, look at that, sir. I got the double kill. Do I get some monies for that? Do I get some prize monies? Prize monies? No, no, no. Why not? No, no prize monies. No prize money, George. I'm sorry. Well, so, George, tell me, tell me a little bit about what's going on. Obviously, you said to earlier on in the video that you came around to uh, give me some opportunities on some sort of timeshares and anything that I wanted. Um, are you successful in doing that? Well, sir, uh, basically, um, no, I'm not, I'm not very good at doing this. Uh, what I used to do is I used to work in the, the, the centre. Oh, look at that. I got another double kill, sir. I used to work in the centre. We used to take the phone book ring up and just try and get the bank account details and the thought code from everybody. What's this? I'm gonna use this bloody thing again. I don't know what it is. Look, there's one. There's one. I'm gonna kill him. Oh, there's one. Get him. Look at that, sir. I got him again. Why did I not get a double kill there? Um, because you only killed one person. Now, oh, look at that. Well done. Oh, that's that guy with the bloody shield again, sir. I don't understand why he has to have this shield. What is all that about? Does he not know that a shield does not cover him from his rear? Um, I guess not because you killed him in the rear, didn't you? Do you like doing things to people in the rear, George? Well, what do you mean, sir? There's a lot of rear activity that goes on in Uganda, you know. Look at that, he's again. I shot him in his rear again. Oh, dear, mister. I was too excited at this point, you see. So, yes, um, basically, um, this is a test then, just to see if I'm going to be staying here in the UK or if I get deported. <laughs> Unfortunately, sir, sometimes I'm not allowed to stay in this country. But um, I'm sure that your, your, your public, um, the people here in the United Kingdoms, they will be very, very welcoming to me. Well, they might well be. 
You just you just don't know really, do you? You just don't have a clue. Yeah, well well basically it's uh um um I hold that out the front there. Oh shit, I think I just seen a little immigrant's office. I better go. I just gonna go out the back door, is that okay? Um yeah, if you wanna go out the back door. Oh, hang on, he's gone. Oh, George is gone. And um well he won that match. Well done, George. It was so and you got the last kill as well. You got the last kill as well, George. Thank you, sir. Yep, I'll uh, see you later, George. How did you do in that game? I don't even think you came top, did you? Um, let's have a quick look. Oh, second long time I've loaded up here. Don't know what's going on. So, George, you went 25 for 5. Well done. Well, this has been a Northern Tones production. Well, it's more of a Northern... Is it really? I don't know. Comrade, subscribe.